we uh, said that we're going to talk about this claim, healthcare in Hungary should model the United States of America. Okay, so strongly agree to disagree. Put it in your head now where you want to go. You got it? So don't move until I say five, four, three, two, one, move. Wow, okay. Well, that's very interesting. Tell us why you uh, disagree. I would say that general health care is a thing that should be accessible for everyone. And I don't think that's so good in the United States. Not many people can pay the high costs. So I don't think that health care in Hungary should be like that. So you're, you disagree because of high cost yeah. and accessibility. Yeah. Got it. Yes, uh, the same actually, because I think it's uh, in the USA, not many people have access to uh, health care or they can, they have a high fever and they uh, say, oh no, I can't go to the hospital because it uh, costs too much. And I think that's not right because you can die probably <laughs> in your own uh, room and nobody sees it because it uh, costs too much to go to the hospital and get some help. Okay, then how come... You two aren't on the strongly disagree line. I don't know. <laughs> Maybe I, I should. You want to move? Yes. How come you're not on the strongly disagree line? You, you can move or not move. You can move the other any way you want. Yeah. Because I, because I, I also think there are some good points. Like they have many hospitals in many areas, which is not so much here. So there, not not everything is bad, but I think the points I said are some very strong points. So the good points are there more facilities for people to go to. I would say yeah. Did that convince you to move back? Uh, yes, that's good. <laughs> okay. okay. And and uh, so why are you on the disagree line? I have to say I would like repeat the same things. The main reason is like the access, the ability to like. Um, get to this health care insurance. Yeah, I don't know. And there are the reasons that... Accessibility and money. Yeah. Okay. So you, you slightly disagree. Tell us why. Uh, so a friend of mine, he is from Canada, and he said it's mostly like we have a way worse um, picture of the healthcare system here than what it's like in America. Like you, ha you can go to hospitals, but most of the people want to have the best doctors, and that costs a lot of money. Um, but I s still disagree uh, with the state uh, statement because... I think, for example, the prices for the medications, like insulin, is so high that people... In, in the U.S.? Yeah. Compared, like in Germany, you get it for free by the insurance without having to pay anything. Or like, I mean, at least five euros, but it's compared to the uh, insulin price in America. I think it's very cheap. So that's what she said, price. And w what do you think about... So it's more expensive in the U.S. and you don't like that? Yeah, just like the medications. Like in Germany, you can get medications prescribed by a doctor and they are for free. And then in the U.S., you still have to pay for the medication. Okay. And that's obviously you think that's bad. Yes, because most people, when they're working, they pay their loans, they pay their houses, children and everything. They m most likely don't have enough money to pay for that. So that gets to her other point of accessibility. Fewer people have access. Well, they have the access, but they won't use it because they don't have the money to. Okay, so every, every single thing you've said tells me you should be on the disagree line. I think still think because of the education of the doctors. So I think there are many good doctors. So the healthcare system is good, but uh, just not how it's provided to the people. So you think, so the question is, healthcare in Hungary should model the USA. You, you, so you think that the, it, you, you, you slightly disagree. And the reason that you're not on the disagree line is because you think that the doctors in the USA are very good and have what better training than here or what? Not better training, but good training. Like when I would disagree, I feel like I put their work down a little bit because they still put so much effort in it. They want to try to help the people, but just because by law they cannot really do something. Okay. Okay. So now I have a question. So, um, 
So we talked about the advantages and the disadvantages. Uh, accessibility and price are the disadvantages, but there are more hospitals, but people can't access them because they don't have enough money. Is that right? Can you think of any other advantages or disadvantages that the United States or Hungary has in terms of health care? Um, maybe they have more... Um, United States. Yeah. They have more, like, um, future technology than here sometimes. Like, uh, the hospitals are better um, stuffed. Like, they have better equipment than sometimes in the hospital here in Hungary. Do, do they have better equipment here than in Germany, or would you know? Or I would rather say in Germany, like, it's most of the time better. Like, in more, like here in Pech or, like, in Hungary, we have uh, less big hospitals. Like, in the big hospitals, it's equally the same, but in the small hospitals, it's right. worse. Okay. So, um, is there anything that I could say to you... Well, let me go to this line. Is there anything I could say to you that would make you move to the strongly disagree line? Is there any argument, any fact, any piece of data, any reason that would make you move one line to the right? Anything? I don't think so. I don't want it to be that hard now. Okay. <laughs> to go, like, to okay. That's, that's completely reasonable. Yes, there are some good points in America, for sure, for sure I think, but then... I disagree with the healthcare model in general because of the high prices and the accessibility and but the good points are there so yeah I would say the same I understood what Shatina said it's not a problem of the doctors they are really really good it's a problem of the complete system and not only of them so mm. yeah well is there anything I could say that would convince you to move one line to the left it would depend on what you're telling me. <laughs> what would I have to tell you to make you move one line to the left? Maybe there's, there's a change in the prices for the people. Or that, that that's actually something happening there. I mean, it's a topic we're talking about like so many years now. And it's a problem that's known for so many years and still nothing has changed. So... So if I were to tell you, and I'm not telling you this, but if I were to tell you that like, there's some law passed to make medicine cheaper, you, you, you would move to the slightly disagree? I would say yes. Would you? Yes. Would you? It would be a reason, yeah. So it really is for you about the cost for people to afford drugs then and the cost of medical care. I mean, that really is the reason. Uh, not only the drugs, some uh, technology like MRT or CT are also very, uh, cost very much. The cats can? Yes. Okay. Is there anything that I could say to you to move you to the neutral? Probably yes, but uh, you have to tell me what. <laughs> what, would it, what would it be? You tell me what I could tell you to move you to the neutral. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> like, I have to say, like, Hungary isn't that bad, the system. So I would say America can even get a bit of the Hungarian healthcare system. So... Yeah, I would probably still like if doesn't if anything change that if nothing changes, I would. Okay, I'm gonna ask you a cu couple tough questions now. Okay, uh, I want you to think in your mind of somebody you love. They need a life-saving operation. You have one of three choices. They can either go to a German hospital. They can go to an American hospital, or they can go to a Hungarian hospital. Now, don't say it out loud yet. Just put it in your mind. Because okay. I don't... When you get it, your mind fixed, say, I got it. I got it. Because I don't want anybody to influence anyone. I want this to be your own decision. And I don't want to influence you either. Someone you love, you, they need a life-saving operation with the current system as it is. Money and all. Where... And you can fly them anywhere to one of those three places. Where should they go? To Germany. Would be my. Huh? No, it would be my opinion. Okay. Germany. Germany. I think also Germany. That is very interesting to me. Why did you say Germany? Because I know how it how it works there. So I had a problem like that, like 
three, two months ago. Oh, I'm sorry. Um, and so I know they took good care of him and everything's fine now. And I know how the system there works and how the doctors were and everything around it. And I think that was pretty good. And what, you used for the same reasons? Um, yes, as well. But I also have to say, like, we, like, we say we know that about the American healthcare system, but, like, we have never been there. So we don't, like, we know it from the internet, from articles, from TV series or whatever. So I cannot, like, put a good, uh, like, found, found, right. founded answer yeah. in, uh, to go to America when I don't know about their system. So I'd rather go to Germany where okay. I know how it works. Did you? Yeah. Yes, I agree with the, these two, but also I know the language. Uh, I don't know Hungarian and I don't speak very good English. So. Your English is great. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> but I know the German language very well and I know how it works there and I know it's, uh, um, it's not struggled by the money because yeah. I have an insurance and yeah. uh, they pay for it uh, and it's a life-saving operation. So, and Why did you pick Germany? For the same reasons, but I just wanted to add that I first was thinking about choosing ha Hungary because of like I just see how good the education here is. Um, and that's the reason maybe, not that they have more experience, but like added with this mm. fact, mm. it would be, I would also trust them. But like for the same reason, I know Germany, the system and the language. And I had my experience in the hospital too, so oh, okay. <laughs> that's the reason. Okay. Um, is there anything I should have asked you that I did not ask you? Are you uh, confident now that you're on the right line? Are you more confident now that you're on the right line than when you started playing the game? Yes. Thank you for playing.